All right, guys, so I want to start this video by saying this is speculation. This is specifically my thoughts on what I think we'll be getting and what I've been seeing lately in the game. So this, like I want to make crystal clear, is speculation, and I've been right in the past, and I've also been wrong in the past. So uh, take this with a grain of salt, but I have two things to discuss really quick, guys. So number one, Dragon Ball Legends just posted this image here uh, for Earth Day. If you guys did not know, today is Earth Day. So uh, they uh, pretty much just posted this and said, what green element characters would you like to see in the game? Let us know. Happy Earth Day. So um, the only thing that really stood out to me on this specific image here, and a lot of people caught on to it too, is uh, specifically this uh, Zamasu here, this EX Extreme Zamasu. So uh, in the uh, in the original, basically artwork of this Masu, he does not have two earrings. So they like they literally on purpose added one extra earring. I don't know if this is supposed to be a hint. And uh, and if you guys are saying uh, DB Zoom, not everything is a hint. Yeah, that's true. Not everything is a hint. But when they literally go off their way to add an extra earring to a character that's already, you know, the artwork is finished. So all they have to do is copy and paste that artwork. They decided to literally go right ahead and, uh, you know, post an, 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 an extra earring. So uh, just to make it very clear, the original artwork only has one earring. So I don't know if this is going to be like a hint for a merge corrupt Zamasu. Uh, because I have a couple hints to go off of here and a, a couple of stuff to discuss. So um, that's something I noticed right away. I don't know if there's going to be some Zenkai hints in here. Maybe this OG Piccolo that needs it more than everybody else, honestly. But uh, yeah, I, I, I think this might be a hint for uh, Corrupt Samasu. Coming for the 30th anniversary now, a lot of you guys also might be saying, DB Zoom, what about Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta? That's definitely not out of the, out of the occasion, guys. Um, by the way, I believe that the 30th anniversary will indeed have a dual uh, banner. So there's going to be two banners in the 30th anniversary. One with probably GT and another with like Tournament of Power slash Future. I, I, I'm not quite sure how that's going to work or DBS. So... Uh, we're going to discuss if Mershamasu does indeed come out. And by the way, that's my most anticipated character for, for me. Uh, I just love, it's my favorite design of out of the whole DB universe is uh, Mersh Corrupt Samasu. He just looks really, really cool. But um, yeah, let's just discuss a few stuff here first. So we did just get this banner right here, the Force of the Fourth. I believe this was a hint as to what we might be getting. So what really stood out to me in the Force of the Fourth banner is specifically one thing. And that's, uh, we did indeed get uh, Super Saiyan 4 Goku, right? So we got Super Saiyan 4 Goku, but the only thing is that that's all we got. We got Super Saiyan 4 Goku, and we also got a random Goku Black. So I, I took I took it upon myself to actually kind of just dig in that Goku Black really, um, you know, just to check to see what this is all about. So this is the Goku Black, the extreme uh, blue Goku Black that we got. And this is his image assets. So we can see what's inside of his, uh, this guy's image. And what we see here is indeed... Uh, if we scroll up really quick, it's Hope of Sword Trunks. And you can see him in the background as well. Hope of Sword Trunks is there. And uh, and I believe this is all kind of leading towards uh, this right here, which is, you know, uh, Mersamasu. So what you guys see right now is actually Dokkan, uh, Corrupt Mersamasu. So the reason why I pulled him up is just a kind of check that you you can't really um you can't compare dokkan with uh legends but this is just a check what kind of tags he kind of has um not to say that you know if he has specific tags here he's going to have specific tags somewhere else that's not to say that doesn't mean anything at all but we can see here he has two earrings very much so like this image right here two earrings now you you might be saying one of them is um is purple but that's just the blade uh in, in the way of his earrings so that's a reflection of his earrings so uh, but we can see here he has Realm of Gods. So Realm of Gods is very, very similar to um, to God Key in uh, Legends. So he might potentially run God Key and uh, Future, of course, and uh, Potora, which is equivalent to uh, Fusion Warrior. So he for sure will have God Key, Fusion Warrior, Future Saga, and anything else to decide to add in there. So I'm not sure if he's Region or not. Uh, he might he might be Region. I'm not 100% sure on that. Don't quote me on that. Because, uh, yeah, we, we, we don't know, you know, we don't know. So if we just take a quick look at God Key, it's something I really want to point out for you guys fairly, fairly quickly, guys, is um, I believe God Key, although it does have good units, it's actually not one of the best uh, tags you can run, even though it's got vitals. It's actually, never mind, I take it back. It's actually a really, really good, um, you know, it's, a, it's actually really good just because you can run green, green, and then uh, anything of your choosing, kind of like green, green, yellow. So which you can, uh, what a lot of people in the top 200, top 1,000 like to run 
is Vados, and then alongside with Zenkai Beerus, and then either Super Saiyan Blue, uh, Zenkai um, First Year Anniversary Goku, or either that or the uh, base form, uh, Super Saiyan God Vegeta now. Uh, yeah, that's one possibility. Another possibility that they might go towards for the 30th anniversary alongside, of course, Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta, like a dual banner of a Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta banner. And then uh, maybe, um, you know, like a another banner w that involves Merge Corrupt Somasu and uh, Hope Sword Trunks or uh, whatever you want to call it. I probably mispronounced that. Somebody's got to check me in the comment section down below. And by the way, guys, this video is running really late today because I've been having PC issues. I've mentioned that before, but I don't want to keep bombarding you guys with my issues. So... Uh, yeah, but I, I kind of got it fixed. So as of right now, I will be able to record. So that's really good. As long as I could get a video uh, to you guys out every single day, that's my goal. So make sure you guys turn on notifications so you guys do not miss a thing. But let me know what you guys think about this specific image here. I want to see if there's anything else I can, you know, decipher from this image. So uh, besides this uh, Samasu that we just discussed with the two earrings that they decided to add, actually, let's pull up, uh, let's pull up the Samasu real quick, right, guys? Let's just click on uh, let's just click on this Goku Black, and then we can click on Future, and then from Future we can see that EX Mercimasu. So let's check out that Mercimasu for one second, just to check out his artwork, so we can cross check this, guys, because I believe uh, let's see, yeah, see he is clearly missing one earring, uh, the ones who are left, and sp specifically his, his right. So. Uh, yeah, we can see here he has two and here he has one. So that's one big thing right there. Um, and if we just take a look at every single character. So Android 16 already has a Zenkai. Uh, Kefla, she's already pretty good on her own, if I'm being quite honest with you guys. Like, she's good, you know, like, like you don't need to do much with her. Even though she's a little bit outdated at this point, you can still, if you get, if you get stuck in her combo, it's pretty much, you know, she, she'll fare well for herself. Uh, this uh, first form cell and this Vados right here uh, are relatively new, so we don't really need to be. It doesn't really need to be touched. Another thing right here is specifically this Piccolo. Uh, I don't know why this Piccolo has kind of like a Zenkai background. I don't want to. I don't want to jump the gun. It might be his original background. Um, it probably is, you know, his original background, but uh, it might be a Zenkai Piccolo. If that's the case, I might, you know, of course, 100% Zenkai him because then I can buff my. Uh, uh, good boo, so <laughs> that would actually be really nice. Um, other than that, guys, that's pretty much all there is to this image. And don't forget, there's also that Goku uh, Black uh, EX with the background of um, Hope Store Trunks. So uh, there's a lot of uh, good things that's going to lead up towards the uh, third year anniversary, which is specifically right now. It's literally right now, but uh, besides everything else, uh, a Mercer Mas would be really, really cool. Um, he would have future. He would have, um, you know, probably God key because this has realms of gods and he has Patora as well. So that's e equivalent to uh, fusion warrior. And uh, he might have uh, Trunks future saga, you know, like the Trunks future saga. We might start seeing some stuff like that. Very similar to um, very similar to the EX extreme nail, how he buffs on uh, uh, Namekian sagas or uh, the Frieza saga, right? Frieza Z saga. So uh, we might see some of that in the future because that's that's how they expand the game. So, uh, but yeah, guys, let me know what you guys think and uh, make sure you guys drop a like, subscribe if you haven't already because I always cover everything Dragon Ball Legends and I always always great greatly appreciate it. It takes literally one second to subscribe and uh, yeah, I'll definitely catch you guys in the next one. Have a good one, peace.